Yeah, you're not waking up to a view like this every morning when you're home, are you? Another beautiful evening in the big land, Matthew. No, can't beat this. Can't do it. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, look at that guy. No, that is fast. <laughs> that is yes, bad. Sir. Oh man, beauty, Philip. Look at that. Now oh, that is nice. Here we go. That's a beauty, buddy. Coming down in sheets. Wow. Oh man. Ah! <laughs> And it's a great day to be alive I know the sun's still shining when I close my eyes And there's my ride coming. Matthew here to pick me up. Late as usual. Matthew, what happened? You fall asleep? <laughs> 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 Woo! Good to be back here, buddy. Looking forward to this. Can't been, wait. Been waiting way too long for this. <laughs> Catch some nice big trout. Oh, jeez, it's gonna be good. I was heading out to my truck, and the neighbor was there. So the next thing I got talking to her, and I was even just telling her, "Yeah, I'm going to the airport now. Pick up my buddy. We're on fishing now for five days." And then the phone rang, and I was like, "Oh, fuck, easy." <laughs> <laughs> To load up Piker's old John boat. Yeah, it's a bit of gear for that little boat, but I think she can. Uh, I think she can handle it. No trouble to tell you're in the big land with all these flies. Surprisingly, Pike, they're not too bad yet, though. I think it's too hot out. Wait till this evening. <laughs> It'll be absolute maggoty. And there she be, all loaded down, ready to rock and roll. Matthew, are you excited? <laughs> yeah, if we got a portage any bit at all, which according to the maps shouldn't be too bad. Like a few rivers we gotta go through, but hopefully they're deep enough. That's the only thing that will have this, you know, that'll stop us and, and you know cause us have to, you know get out and, and just uh, line the boat down the river. But other than that, it hopefully should be smooth sailing. Six o'clock, hopefully we'll uh, we'll make camp, set up the old base camp and uh, evening troll.
Hopefully we start off the trip now with a with a dandy trout or a pike this evening. And we're not afraid of a few monsters. <laughs> <laughs> So our start point brings us just off the Trans Labrador Highway, approximately 85 miles west of Goose Bay. From there we take a route through five large bodies of water the locals refer to as 1st, 2nd, 3rd, 4th and 5th Pond. Our objective? May camp on an island in 5th Pond. As a result of low water levels, this route covering approximately 15 kilometers took us around 3.5 hours. This is the cabin we stayed at a few years ago, Pike. I believe you lost a few dollars in crib, or did I? I can't remember. <laughs> I caught that. I caught that five pounder. That's all that mattered for me. I caught a dandy trout last time I was here, right, just down from the truck, really, on that side of the shore. Yeah, it's been on and off showers. I don't know if uh, you can pick it out on the camera or not, but over there you can see rain coming down, thunder shower passing through. We got a few on the on the highway coming in here. Hopefully they hold off a bit. Yeah, really. Off and on, rain, sun. Another small little sun shower. Off and on all day in a bike. Captain at Matthew Pike. on the move, no? Get rid of some of those flies. Oh yeah. And here comes the rain. Lots of it. Doesn't look like the rain's going anywhere anytime soon either. Goddamn rain clouds followed us all the way in. Oh well, could be worse. <laughs> could be working. Good thing we got the dry sacks. And here we are, just coming up on the, the head of Fifth Lake. Out of gas? Yeah. And we just ran out of gas. I'm gonna pick an island. Now uh, find an island to camp on for the night. Well, for the whole five days, really. Too difficult. There's a good few islands around. Of course, the benefit of an island is uh, 
we don't gotta worry about any bears taking off our food. So that's what we're gonna go for. Got a freaking soap process. Got a dandy spot there. Nice little beach area. Is that right? <laughs> you go check this place out. Oh yeah, it's a dandy spot. Dandy dandy. Trace again here now. Just in time for the five tomorrow. What a downpour that was. <laughs> yeah, it uh, that wind picked up pretty good and uh, and the rain came down in sheets. I was gonna dandy spot here. Picnic table left here. There must have been a bit of work to bring that in. That picnic table. That must have been a bit of work. What? Jeez, that's a good slow to bring that in, man, in a boat. We'll set up camp now and uh, get a quick snack and hopefully try for a trout if time allows. Hopefully Robbie will soon realize that I have no idea what the hell I'm doing and he'll come help me with my tent. I think I'm about to have a brain fart. Whoa, there it is. Well, let's try this again. For you? No, man, Jesus. <laughs> what a good one. <laughs> First night in the big land. And it's a beauty. Our sponsor, Smithwick's Premium Red Ale. Oh, absolutely. 4.5% brewed in fucking lovely Ireland. Oh, you can't beat it. What a taste. Yeah. <laughs> you can't, really can't beat it. It's one of the best bears on the go, and it, go, it tastes even better when you're up in the middle of Labrador, back country, in the nighttime, beautiful night. Yeah. You can't beat a nice Smithwicks. No. Can't beat this. Can't do it.
beauty. Matthew's gone down there to fetch a bit of water for the kettle. No problem to get some solar power going today. She's splitting the rocks out there. Yeah, you're not waking up to a view like this today morning when you're home, are you? Matthew might have just caught the first fish of the trip. Oh, he definitely did. <laughs> Never mind. My first stick. <laughs> Matthew, this time hopefully he got the first fish of the day. Oh yeah, that's a big one. Your line's fucking right wrapped up mine. I know. Oh, no, it's good to know. Get the net out. Ooh. Pike. Finally, we got some success here. Here we go. <laughs> what? Don't worry, I got <laughs> Just came out? Yeah. Just back to camp there now. Just got a little bit of firewood. Pike's filling his face. <laughs> Mr. Noodles for lunch. And two and a snack. There we go, a nice quick lunch. Had to let the fire keep the flies down a bit because they're maggoty. Mostly the stouts now. After lunch, you're gonna cut a bit of firewood, cut some more firewood, junk it up, and uh, make a few splits and whatnot, and then uh, go for a trout. Nothing to it. Nope. That's good. That's why I invited him. <laughs> Be a man and jump in by. 30 degrees in Labrador. Fucking time to go for a swim. certainly refreshing. Oh, still nothing. Fishing slow. You play cornhole. I mean, beanbag toss. <laughs> so he lost in the cornhole. <laughs> now he's going to try his luck in crib again. <laughs> yeah. not getting all luck. <laughs> Up 10 bucks already. Oh, life's good. Supper tonight. Eating my kings up here, Matthew. Can't wait. Listen to that sizzle. Mm -mm -mm. And we have some rice on the side. Could be good. Bon appetit. <laughs> oh, Matthew with uh, another fish on, but it looks of it.
Not a beautiful evening in the big land, Matthew. And trouting is not the best, unfortunately. Yeah, three pike in there. Uh, I had on a dandy. How big the? Three pounds. Three, four pound trout, but I lost them. God damn it. I would have made a nice meal. A little bit more and I'll get him back. Back to the game now and a few drinks. And enjoy the beautiful scenery. Wakey, wakey, Matthew. <laughs> oh, the maggoty. Maggoty flies. Yeah, we'll get up and get a little snack now and hit the water. Mr. Pike! Yeah, that's the same one I chased it before. Breakfast is champions right there. The fishing is slow, you drink beer. <laughs> or rattlers. <laughs> or rattlers. Some of us drink beer, some of us drink rattlers. And when the fish is slow, you also beat Matthew in crib. <laughs> I'm about to cook the salmon, and the thunder is a rolling. We might get a downpour. I don't know. Yeah, there's the thunder. Yeah, over off the horizon, it's definitely green. Over there. We still got a lot of overcast, somewhat blue skies here, so. Might be fine. Oh no, the winds are picking up. There's like a storm about to start. This could get interesting. <laughs> 